Hi guys, sorry I'm a little stuffed up, allergies are getting to me. So this is what my hair looks like before I do anything to it. It's really frizzy because I got a perm seven months ago. Um, so I got this really good uh, straightener and it's going to make my hair look really good. So I'm going to part my own hair in half because I'm going to be curling my hair and showing you guys how to curl your hair with a straightener. So I'm going to take the half and split it in half again, brush out all the tangles, and then I'm going to show you how to curl your hair with a straightener. Um, I am going to fast forward the video because I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to watch me do my whole entire hair for the whole 15 minutes that it took me. But even then, that's still a really short time to do your hair, especially curling. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my hair and I'm going to put the straightener on it and I'm going to twist it outwards and then bring the hair out in front and if you just watch and see how I do it you'll be able to see how it's done because it took me a long time to watch a whole bunch of videos to figure out how to do it but after I got the hang of it I figured it out see how I have the hair out of the straightener from on the bottom so you're gonna Take a piece of hair and you're going to put it in there and turn it away from you and then pull your hair around the straightener out so you can see the hair. Just like that. And as you can see, these curls are really cute and they last about 12 hours. Um, I think they last longer than that. Usually when I curl my hair, it never lasts. It, it's like gone an hour in or 30 minutes because my hair is so long. I do have this one piece of hair that does not want to curl so um, please excuse me for my weird faces. And of course anytime someone's doing their hair gonna mess up sometimes so it's okay if you mess up. It's trial and error. Practice makes perfect. And then this is my face getting irritated with it taking so long when I'm only about seven minutes in. The top is the quickest part. This is the piece that didn't want to curl. I don't know what was wrong with it. It just didn't want to curl. It, I don't know. Everyone has that one strand of hair that just doesn't like to cooperate. Well, that's this one. So don't mind me messing with it and playing around in my chair being a weirdo. It's the second time I'm trying to do it now. And it still didn't work. There goes the third time. And I finally got it. So we moved on. Thank God. And then that piece of hair still didn't work to curl. So now I'm going over it for the fourth time. I don't understand why this piece of hair did not want to curl. It was just so irritating. I went over it like five, seven times. I'm like, whatever, I'll go back to it. <laughs> All right, so we're going to do the top half of my hair. Please don't mind my weird faces and my ugly face. Um, so I'm going to keep parting the hair, and I'm going to go from the very tip top and I'm going to go all the way down. And again, make sure you pull that piece of hair in front of the straightener. Because sometimes if you don't pull it in front of the straightener, it will unravel as you pull it down and then you won't have a curl. 
the reason why I love sh curling my hair this way is because it stays in your hair forever and I don't have time to keep going back and curling my hair. Once I do my hair, I would like it to stay, but it usually never works out that way. So that's why I choose this method because it's the best method I have found out there. I have my 25 years of existence. So that's going to be the reason why. All right, I'm almost done here. I, I think I messed up here, but I think I managed to fix it. Then there I go again playing with my chair because I think it's fun and I have an inner child in me and it always comes out and it's so embarrassing. There's that other piece that I told you that would not curl so I went back to it obviously. So this is probably like my seventh time trying to curl this damn piece of hair and it still doesn't want to curl. Like, look at that. Like, what the hell? I did the same thing I did every single time, and it just didn't want to curl. Hopefully, it works this time. Actually, I think it does work this time. So, you guys can stop staring at my irritated face. And there. Finally, it curled. Alright. On to the last few strands of hair. Now, it depends if you have short hair or long hair. If you have short hair, you want to go down farther because your hair is going to go get poofed up. Try to keep your hair on the iron blades that are inside the straightener or it won't curl like this happened to me. It came out and I didn't want to do it again. I'm a very impatient person sometimes, especially when it comes to girly stuff. I am a tomboy at heart. See, there I go. I mess up again because no one is perfect. And there's a perfect example on how to do it right there. I mean, wow, look how beautiful those curls are. And those curls are going to be in there for 12 hours. And you don't have to worry about it. I have two kids. I'm running around everywhere, going to parks, all types of stuff. And it managed to stay in there for me. So... So it took me about 16 minutes to do my hair. Um, usually it takes me about a half an hour and my hair doesn't stay curled. It probably stays curled for about 30 minutes to an hour and that's about it. And it's very disappointing as a woman. <laughs> All right, so that's going to be the finished look. Oh, and I almost forgot. When you brush out your hair, you still have your curls. No matter what you do, they'll still be in there. And you don't have to use no hairspray, mousse, gel, or nothing. I can even go rock out, come back, fix my hair, and it still looks great. And that's just me trying to get everything perfect. I like things to be perfect. And then look again, I brushed it out and it's still there. I love this straightener and I'm going to tell you more about it in just a minute. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, so it's been about an hour since I did my hair um my phone died so I had to charge it it still looks completely the same so I just came on here to tell you what straightener I use um it is a $300 straightener unless you could find them at the mall which I was luckily I did um so it's called the Royal Genuous 
Heating Element Platinum. So that's what it looks like. That's what the back looks like and how it works. This straightener is amazing. I've never had a really good straightener, so this is the first time. And um, he said the curls will last for about 12 hours. I did get my hair curled when I purchased it. He curled my hair for me, which was really nice. Um, and yes, they did stay in all day, all night, and the next morning when I woke up. So I feel like it was longer than 12 hours. This is what it looks like. I got the green one. He has a whole bunch of different colors, and if you want to purchase it, uh, he is at the Meadows Mall right now. Um, he did give me a card if I could find it. Is the card in here? The card is gone, but you can find them here. I had the card. I don't know what happened. I think my son got into it. Go down to this app. You could get in touch with them. But you can find them at the mall and all types of stuff. And eBay. I saw eBay. They were selling it for 80 bucks. That's how much I purchased this for. I thought it was a great steal. I mean, $300 straightener for 80 bucks. I'll take it. So uh, that's about it, you guys. I just wanted to give you my review on this straightener and how I straighten my hair with or with a flat iron and how I get it to last so long and what do I do. So that's going to be about it. I hope you guys enjoyed my video. I know I have some weird faces. I really need to prop up my camera up higher because I'm giving everyone my double chin view. So I'll get better. Until next time, guys, I'll see you later. Um, next time will be um, unboxing some Bella bubble, Bubbly Bella um, bath bombs, the one that comes with the little ring. And then I'll be doing a unique video. And then I will be doing um, people who try weird combinations. So stay tuned, you guys. I have a lot of videos coming. All right. Bye.